Hello Chelsea fans, before we dive into today's hot topic, make sure you hit that subscribe button and join the Chelsea FC News fans community. Stay tuned for the latest updates on our beloved Blues and don't miss out on any breaking news. Now, let's talk about a transfer move that almost happened but didn't quite cross the line. According to a report from Give Me Sport, Chelsea was eyeing Everton's star striker. Dominic Calvert-Lewin, and they had a surprising offer in mind. The Blues were willing to send Axel de Sassi to Everton in exchange for Calvert-Lewin. However, the Merseyside club wasn't too keen on the proposal and decided to reject it. Both de Sassi and Wesley Fofana, who wasn't part of this deal but is in a similar situation, haven't been key players for Chelsea. De Sassi has struggled to secure regular playing time and Fofana was loaned out to Union Berlin and Burnley last season. Moving to Everton could have given these players a fresh start with more consistent football. But Everton, understandably, didn't want to part ways with Calvert-Lewin, especially so late in the transfer window. Calvert-Lewin is arguably their best striker and losing him would have been a significant blow as they aim to improve on a shaky start to the season. Everton has had a rough start to the Premier League campaign, and holding on to their top players like Calvert-Lewin is crucial for their survival in the league. They've been battling relegation for the past two seasons, and it remains to be seen if they can turn things around in the coming weeks. As for Chelsea, it seems the club is looking to offload some of its fringe players soon. De Sassi, earning £80,000 per week, and Fofana, on £30,000 per week, make a combined £110,000 per week in wages. Offloading these players would have freed up funds to cover Calvert-Lewin's salary of £100,000 per week. By moving these players on, Chelsea could reduce their wage bill and reinvest in higher quality signings. Even though the Premier League transfer window is closed, other leagues still have their windows open. It'll be interesting to see if Chelsea can take advantage of this and find new homes for De Sassi and Fofana. And what about Everton? They still need to bolster their squad, and we'll have to wait and see if they can bring in the right players to support Calvert-Lewin come January. Everton is a big club, and they should be aiming for a top-half finish. The right signings could help them bounce back strongly. So, Chelsea fans, what do you think? Should Chelsea have pushed harder to land Calvert-Lewin? And what are your thoughts on De Sassi and Fofana potentially leaving the club? Let us know in the comments below. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe to Chelsea FC News fans for more updates. See you in the next video.